Yeah, I guess, yeah, might as well. Okay. You sell it? Yeah. All right. This is the scoped most of the got with the turn down bolt. This is a 43 range receiver. So let's try it out. This scope needs to be shimmed, but I can at least still get the target on. So. All right. I'm going to shoot for the second to the left. Here it goes. Should we put the shutter down? What? No, because it's not going to shoot out. Okay. How'd you think? Uh, it's a little bit to the right. It's a little bit to the right. I'm going to shoot again just to see if it's the accuracy of the gun or just natural drift. Yeah, it's shooting a little bit to the right. So. Can you compensate by aiming a bit more to the left? Would that help? No, I can, I can change the rectangle. No. Down the bottom. Bottom far left. Yep. It's about an inch or two low, but it's getting there. How far is away is it from the first two bullet holes? What? Is it grouped pretty well with the first two bullet holes, or far enough away? Uh, yeah, it's far enough away now. <laughs> How's that? Still a little bit off. Do one more. Yeah, it's pretty close. Hmm. It's almost right on. I got the middle target next to you. Which one were you aiming for, target-wise? Uh, Second to the left. Okay. Oh, good job. Smooth. Smooth operator. <laughs> That's the first time we shot this from what? <laughs> About, I would say probably a year or so. Yeah, it was about March this time last year. Which one wish I had a scope? See how well I do instantly. Yeah, I was going to say, with that scope, it makes it a lot easier. That black target's hard to see. We'll just go out there in a little bit and see.
Picking up on it. The recoil. I don't know. Uh, when you look at the footage, you'll be able to tell. All right, let's take a look. See how you did. Here's yours, dude. Not not bad. Not shabby at all. The only problem is I wish I had known which of those shots those were. Yeah, and that's where having the red one's gonna do it. You know what, you should go over here on your next set. Yeah. Just so you, then you'll be able to see from a distance. But look at mine, these are the first two before I adjusted. And then I basically kind of hit, almost creeping in like this. I think one of these is a little drifted. I, I thought I had it centered, but it's still shooting to the right a little bit, so. See how we do. Welcome to Mosin Nagant Part 2. Part 2. Vasily uh, Zaitsev Boogaloo. <laughs> Alright. a little low. I kicked up dirt behind one of my targets. Yeah, it's it's a little low. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Ah, that's why. Yeah, they told me that I'd have to turn it down a lot more. Musket over there. Yeah, yeah, see that. In the middle of where? That one that hole right back there? How was that? That seemed a little off. I think for you, the recoil is affecting your trigger pull. See, mine really started. Okay, so these are the first like few here. The pattern is really wide all of a sudden. I think either the barrel's getting too hot, or the scope was getting loose, or both. So this next next time around, I need to. Who's not?